Good morning, I bid to our biomanufacturing lecturer, Miss Azi, and all my fellow friends. I would like to talk about muscle glue, super glue. Muscles, as we know, are seafood delicacy that are often served next to lobsters and shrimp on the seafood buffet table. But what we do not know is that the feet of the small mollusks are able to produce an epoxy with adhesive-like properties which rivals any superglue available in the market today. The invention started when the US military is looking for a new strong waterproof adhesive. Thus, scientists with the idea that sea creatures have been clinging naturally underwater are quickly put into research. Unfortunately, what they found out was that it takes about 10,000 muscles or mollusks to produce only one gram of this adhesive, therefore resulting in prohibitive cost and depletion of this muscle population. So they are developing new methods to clone the muscle gene through DNA technology that will allow them to economically produce large quantities of these adhesive proteins. Because seawater breaks down even the strongest of conventional adhesive there is to found, so a natural alternative is important to the Navy and private marine industry in building and repairing their ships. Mollusks, as we know, attach to ships which will then increase the drag and decrease the efficiency of these large vessels. Therefore, understanding this adhesive will eventually help to prevent this marine fouling. Besides that, the building industry also requires a strong cementing element for manufacturing plywood and other building material materials that are often and are easily deteriorate, deteriorate when they are subjected to water and moisture. Even the dental industry is looking for a better and safer adhesive for dentures and medical disciplines such as surgery. And orthopedics are interested in new sutures and prosthetic technology. From the comic, we can see that the proteins from this muscle not only helps in building and repairing ships or in building materials, but they are also convenient or they can also help humans in closing wounds. Muscles are able to cling to surfaces because they produce an attachment threads that are called the bicell threads. As you can see here, threads, thread like, are growing out of the muscles. These are the bicell threads. The foot of the animal has organs that secrete proteins with catalysts. It takes about a minute for the viscous substance to harden into a thread attaching itself to a new surface. It enables the muscle to anchor to rocks and pilings in turbulent areas where food and oxygen are more abundant. As you can see here, the threads are attached to rocks. Therefore, even though there is a harsh sea current, the muscle will not budge and will stay at the area where they can get food and oxygen the most. Scientists are now identifying the five proteins that go into the thread makeup that constitute to the glue. 
um, cloning the muscle protein is expected to be the crucial step in opening doors for developing this amazing epoxy. The ability of the muscle to remain intact in seawater is only one advantage of the muscle glue offers. It doesn't require high temperature to activate its cementing qualities as to other conventional waterproof glues. Besides that, it is also environmentally safe because it comes straight from nature, unlike the standard petroleum and tar-based glues that are now being used. As a conclusion, this natural superglue would be the best solution for various parties that face problems relating to the production of strong waterproof glue. Thank you very much.